on the shores of the Puget Sound. We're in Seattle, Washington. Let's head down to the coin toss now. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Gross is lined up to kick this one off, and you can feel the thunder in the crowd as they await the start of this game. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Feeds it to the back. Nice run, and he's brought down. Gaining four yards. That makes it second and six. From their own 29-yard line. Second down. The lineman got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. False start. Offense. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. right around the 22-yard line. The blockers tried to sell the misdirection, but the defenders stayed home and made the play. That's the kind of effort a coach likes to see from his defense. From their own 22-yard line, it's third down. Catches it, and that's all. I'd say that went about as well as the defense hoped it would. Fourth down. And watch out, they're going to bring the heat right here. Lions fields it at the 30, tackles at the 42-yard line. McMillan is going to take the field for the first time now in front of the home crowd. And his skill set and this offense really gives this team an opportunity to be very, very good. He's one of our favorites to watch, Kurt. Well, I think it's going to be interesting to see if this offense goes to him right away and see just give him a chance to make a big play. The other thing I want to see is how is this defense going to adjust to where he is aligned on the field? Are they going to use double coverage to try to slow him down? From their own. 42-yard line. Second down. Just throws this one away. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Brought down in the open Field. You don't always need to throw the ball with a lot of zip, although it does help in some cases. When you have accuracy like this guy, you can make all the throws. From the 47-yard line, first down. Looking for the corner. Slides down to the ground. With the carry. That's good for a gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Caught, and he's hit immediately. Looks like the defense was in man coverage there, fellas, and that's why they stopped that screen. Yeah, and when the secondary isn't dropping back into zone, it makes it difficult to have success with that kind of screen play. And here's another third down. He scrambled, and he tackles him hard at the 48-yard line. That's a loss of five yards. That makes it fourth and 12. And they could really put their opponent in bad field position with a good punt here. He really got a hold of that one. 
This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Barnes sets up the play action. He goes out of bounds at the 23. That'll make it second and seven. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Got it and brought down immediately. Hampton brings him down at the 28-yard line. That'll bring up 32. And he hits him hard at the 26. Loss of two on the play. That makes it fourth and four. Lions is back to receive. Lions fields it at the 35. Tackle made at the 45-yard line. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. Tackle made right around the 48-yard line. Call it a gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. From their own 48-yard line, it's second down. And he's taken down around the 42-yard line. What a run. Here they give it to the tailback and a little misdirection play. And you can see the athleticism and the ability to make guys miss. Nice play. Fakes the handoff, and he's in trouble. And he's immediately tackled. I'm really liking what I see from this guy. He's not afraid to go to the air on any down. From the 31-yard line, first down. He's taken down at the 34. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup and come out a bit more motivated next time. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Tackle at the 31. Gain of three on the play. That brings up third and ten. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. Four down, four down. Mike three. Mike three. Down. Caught with room to work. He's tackled around the 24-yard line. That's good for a gain of seven yards. Fourth down. Washington is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and it's good! Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. Three-nothing, Washington. Gross, ready to kick. from his own goal line. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. Washington's looking awfully impressive right now on defense, but we are in the first quarter. Yeah, this is about a dominant first quarter that we have seen in a long time. But let's see if they can continue to play this well throughout the rest of the ball game. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And he's tackled at the 25-yard line. The halfback just couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage. Loss of one. And I'll tell you what, not only was this great penetration, but it was a heck of a hit, too. It's second and 12. Ball on their own 25. Looks like he flinched down there on the line. False start, false start. offense. Sometimes what happens on a false start is a lineman will see movement on the other side of the ball and be coaxed into jumping early. 
the Utes running back taken out earlier, sidelined with that injury. However, it looks like he's going to be able to come back in this game. Gives it left side. And he is drilled at the 32-yard line. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That'll bring up third They're about four yards away here on third down. And he's leveled at the 24-yard line. Wow, oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. This is a great punt-blocking team, and it looks like they're going to try to get to this one. And down he goes at the 44. Let's get some points going right now. Not a lot of offense here in the opening quarter. I'm with you. I'd like to see a lot more offense than we've seen up to this point. Give credit to the defenses, but I think you're going to see both these offense coordinators get more of a feel for things and start to adjust their play calls. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Washington has a three-point lead on the ground with a tailback. Brought down at the 47. Second down and seven. Ball on the 47. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's a game seven on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. Makes it out to about the 30. He got the first down and much more. I'll tell you what, this guy is a threat every single time he touches the ball. From the 30-yard line, it's first down. The Huskies running back. He was injured earlier. You see him down there on the sideline, and it looks like he's ready to get back in the game. Makes the catch, and he might take it. Here he goes. And down he goes. 15-yard line. Defense goes with the extra defensive backs as the offense comes up five wide. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 11. That makes it second and six. Second and six. Ball on the 11-yard line. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Nice run up the middle. Washington is up by three. And they make the stop at about the three-yard line. First and goal from the three. They're knocking on the door. They'll spread the field with five wide. And they got him for a loss. He was never able to get ahead of steam on that carry. That brings up second and goal. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Three down, three down. Mike three, Mike three. Pumble, pumble, pumble. Puts on a move. Touchdown. And he converts the extra point. A nice nine-play, 56-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. So our score, 
10 nothing. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 29. The Huskies really came prepared to play defense today, and the plan is working. Well, so far in this game, you've got to tip your cap to the defensive coordinator. He has clearly done a very good job of getting his team ready to play, and they have done a nice job of slowing down this very explosive offense. They need to show a little giddy-up now, because if they don't start eating into this deficit, they could easily fall out of the game. There was some movement on the line. False start, False start. offense. offense. Maybe he got the cadence wrong coming out of the huddle. The coaches have a low threshold for mistakes like that. So the penalty makes it first and 15. Fires out to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the 34-yard line. You can tell he's got a lot of faith in his wide receivers. Even when he's a little bit off target, they can pull it in and make something happen. So at the end of one, Washington leads it 10-0. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Feeds it to the back. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. That'll make it third and five. Third and five. Ball in the 34. Going long. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. This is a very well-coached defense. They know to get their hands up in the air and to try to knock down passes. Lions, back to return it. Oh, excellent punt. He's tackled at the 32. Return for a gain of nine yards. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. And he carries the ball for a nice game. From their own 37-yard line, second down. After a decent pickup. That's a gain of four on the play. That'll make it third and one. Nice catch. First down, and he's knocked out. Gain of 13 yards. From the 46 yard line. First down. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. First down. He gets out to about the 21-yard line. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive? This offense right now is on a drive. I mean, this is their third first down. They're doing just about anything they want, and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down. From the 21-yard line, first down. He gets out to about the 11-yard line. That'll make it second in inches. Right. 
Gets to about the eight-yard line. It's first down, and he'll be looking for six points here. Up the middle for a nice game. It's the ninth play of the drive. Fires out quickly to the tailback. Touchdown, Huskies! It's really hard to defend the pass with your back to the end zone. It can also be difficult for an offense because the field tightens up. That was a nice play. And he hits the PAT. A nine play, 67 yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. So the score now, 17 nothing. They line up to kick this one away. Parks from the four. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 22-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but i got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Bentley off the left side. He's out to the 30. He's to the 40. And they push him out at the 49-yard line. Gain of 27 on the play. That makes it first and 10. First and 10. Ball on the 49-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's good for a gain of four yards. That brings him second and five. Runs it, and he stops short of the line of scrimmage. No gain. Third down. From the 47-yard line, it's third down. There's a strike complete. Matthews picks him up six yards with a catch. That makes it fourth and inches. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Zips it to the back. Got an opening. He's pushed out of bounds. Right around the 28-yard line. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. The quarterback in the gun. Empty backfield. Five wide receivers in the formation. He fights forward to about the 30. And he makes it out to about the 31-yard line. Gain of one yard. That brings up second and nine. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on the 31-yard line. Mike three. Set. Oklahoma. He's tackled at the 41-yard line. That's a team Knocked out of bounds at the 50-yard line. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. That brings up second and one. Hey. 
Gets to about the 47-yard line. Steps out of bounds at the 45. That's good for a two yards. That makes it second. This is the eighth play of this drive. Hands it off. And he's taken down at the 45 yard line. No game. That'll bring up third and eight. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 37. around the 36 yard line tenth play of the drive got it complete he's out of bounds First and ten. Ball on the 19. Throws a bullet. Fires quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. And the secondary didn't quite seem alert enough to defend that pass. He makes the PAT. An 11 play, 81 yard drive. And the result, seven points. The score now, 24-0. Gross, ready to kick. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 25-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. it out. Tackle made right around the 26-yard line. From their own 26-yard line, it's second down. Short over the middle. Washington's going to take their first time out of the half. As long as they're making completions and positive yards when they go to the air, then it can't be too bad of a play. Zips it to the tight end, and he's tackled at the 30. I don't know what game plan this offense is running, but it might need to be reassessed by this coaching staff. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. And down he goes to 39-yard line. Washington's put themselves in a great position now as they head into the second half. Well, in the first half, we saw a lot of big playability, and just a lot of, just an explosive approach by this offense. But remember, we'll see what happens here in the second half. This is a long way from being over. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. That's just a great call by the coordinator there, going to the air on first down. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. On the 
the pitch. Look out. Loose ball. And it's scooped up by the running back. They nearly gave that ball away. But luckily, that guy was paying attention to what was going on and was able to recover the football. Got a receiver, and he dropped it. Terrific coverage. And when you clog up passing lanes like that, you can force a quarterback to make some poor decisions. Almost got themselves a turnover, too. From the 22-yard line, it's third down. Finds his man, and they take him down immediately. Game seven on the play. That makes it fourth and four. It's up, and he's got it. Washington, the kick. Parks from the six. Coverage teams don't often get a lot of credit, but boy, these guys did an excellent job of getting downfield, avoiding blocks, and limiting the return yards. It was a quick three and out on their last possession. This offense needs to start playing some emotional football. He's taken down around the nine-yard line. Jackson gains about a yard on the play. That makes it second and eight. We played a half of football. Washington leads it 27 0. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 halftime show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Maybe the most important statistic from the first half. No turnovers for either team. So far, a good job of ball security, but now you wonder if the quarterbacks can avoid putting the ball in jeopardy. They're going to want to make a big play, and that might sort of set off a feeding frenzy on the defensive side. Yeah, and it's in, in defenses, that's the number one priority. I mean, you can give up a lot of yards. You can, they can chew up yards up and down the field, but if you can force turnovers, then you're keeping them off the scoreboard, and, and that's your number one goal. So I... Defenses, they, they have to be a little bit upset right now, and they got to try to find ways to, to hit harder. How about when you're tackling? Use the strip stick. You know, be able to strip the ball out, get the ball out, try to get some interceptions, try to make some user picks, you know, do whatever you can to try to get the football back from that offense and set your offense up in good field position. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. Davis and Pollock, you should be here instead of Herb Street and myself. The second half just about ready to begin. Davis from the two. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Boy, this offense has been consistent throughout this entire football game. The quarterback's doing a good job of leading this team. How about the offensive line, the job that they've done? Just a great team effort to allow this offense to have a spectacular performance. We're about set to start things up again. Mike three! Mike three! Washington looking to build on this commanding lead here. Here's an opening. Brought down around the 40-yard line. That's a gain of eight on the play. That brings, that brings up, up second, second and one. one. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. A 
halfback is usually not used to making throws like that. Questionable call, but at least they're mixing up their offense a bit and trying to keep the defense on their toes. Quick pass, and down he goes at about the 39-yard line. Loss of one yard on the play. Fourth down. He fields a punt at the 20. Tackle made at the 27-yard line. I hope they show some fight here and try to stay competitive. If you're going to get blown out, you at least want to go down swinging. As a man, he'll lose big yards. From their own 23-yard line, second down. Hands it off inside, brought down. No gain on the play. That brings up third and 14. Got his man, can't tack on any yardage. It'll be short of the first after the completion. A good effort by the defense to make sure they got him before he got to the marker. Lyons is back to receive. Lyons takes it at the 33. Brought down at the 39. Not much luck the last time this offense had the ball. Washington comes to the line in complete control of this game. Nice run there as they work the outside. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. the run. They'll bring him down at about the 45. No gain on the play. That'll bring up third and four. Here's a handoff, and he's brought down right away. That's a loss of one yard on the play. That'll bring up fourth and five. Room around the corner. He fields it at the 17. He steps out at about the 19-yard line. Not a whole lot's been working for them so far. They should just come out and play loose and easy because they've got nothing to lose. Gets it out quickly. And they make the stop around the 32-yard line. Number 48 makes the tackle at the 32-yard line. From their own 32-yard line. First down. Fires out to his wideout, and he's tackled right away. That'll make it second and seven.
incomplete pass and hit hard as he came down with it. Third down and six yards to go. Ball on the 36. Got a man, but he's tackled back behind the line of scrimmage. like they're coming after this punt. 18 yard punt. Out of bounds at the 47 yard line. So we're just about ready to return to action. Washington in control. Thrown. I don't think he got anything on that. And he didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 49. Down. Okay. Ruin. Ruin. And he's immediately tackled. Throw in left. Complete. What a catch. What a play. And that'll set up a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. So after the big pass play, we have a first and goal. He's tackled at the one-yard line. McMillan gains six yards with a short completion. That brings him second and goal. Looking for his man, incomplete. This is where the defense makes a name for themselves. It's third down and goal from the one. He punched that in from a short distance. He had great blocking up front on that play. And he converts the extra point. A six-play, 54-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 27. The Huskies continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. I hope they show some fight here and try to stay competitive. If you're going to get blown out, you at least want to go down swinging. Complete. He's down. That's, That's good, good for a gain of four yards. yards. That, that makes, makes it second, second and six. six. From their own 31 yard line. Man left, man left. Second down. They give to the tailback. Very good tackle in space. Gain of eight yards. That, that makes, makes it first, first and ten. ten. There's a play fake. The pass falls is complete. Number 17 was the intended receiver on the play. 
from their own 39-yard line. It's second down. Gives it to the back. Nice run there. And a six-yard pickup by the halfback on the delay. That'll make it third and five. Incomplete, almost picked off. Hey, I know he dropped it, but the safety put himself in a position to make a play. That's impressive. That'll bring up fourth and five. Lions is the deep man awaiting the return. 20 yard punt. Out of bounds, it's a 35 yard line. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. From their own 37-yard line, second down, Washington with a commanding lead. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Tackle made at the 44-yard line. He tackles him for a loss. Takes him down behind the line. That's a loss of four yards on the play. Fourth down. And this one is a beauty. They'll bring him down at the 26-yard line. Not a whole lot's been working for them so far. They should just come out and play loose and easy because they've got nothing to lose. Zips it to the back. And he's taken down right around the 38-yard line. Number 11 brings him down at the 38-yard line. First down. From their own 38-yard line. First down. Pass incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. He was a little erratic on that pass, but there's no denying that he can really hum it in there. yards. Ball on their own 34. He lets it fly. He was that close to making a big play. His safety is kicking himself for dropping that one. That'll bring up fourth and 13. Lions awaiting the return. at the 38-yard line. So at the end of three, Washington leads it 34-0. Well, folks, we head into the fourth quarter, and this one is a blowout. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. They go with a run. They can't hang on to him. To run. Call it a gain of five, five yards. yards. That, that makes, makes it second, second and six. six. Hey. 
from their own 43-yard line. It's second down. Washington up big. Throws it in a hurry. He's taken down right around the 48-yard line. Number three on the tackle at the 48-yard line. That'll make it a third and one. Five wide. Quick throw. Got it complete, and he's out of bounds. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back to pass. First and 10. Ball on the 41-yard line. Makes it out to about the 33. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That'll bring up second and three. Here's the give. Tackle at the 33. No gain. That'll bring up third and two. Third down again. He gets out to about the 32-yard line. They're going to come up short here on this third down. The defensive line did a great job of getting some penetration, and the overall defensive effort was big there to set up this fourth down. This is to add to an already impressive lead. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he nails the long field goal. This one away. Caught at the eight. He's to the 20. He's out to the 30. And down he goes at the 33 yard line. I don't expect any once in a lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. quickly and he's got his man and he's hit immediately that play was going nowhere yeah give a lot of credit to the defense here recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver second down and six ball on the 36 yard line You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. Caught, and he's hit immediately. Puts it away, and it's a great kick. He fields the punt at the 16. Tackle made at the 29. The Huskies just put on a clinic in this football game. Hey, you can say that again, Brad. In every phase, the defense has been outstanding. The special teams have been solid. And how about this offense and the way they've executed? It's allowed them to build up a very big lead. Well, the defense held them to three on their last possession. Pitching a shutout on this drive would be even better. I expect him to run the ball, kill the clock, and put this one in the books. That is a loss of three yards. That brings up second and 13. From their own 26-yard line, second down. Washington is winning big. I credit the quarterback on that pass. He made a great read and delivered a very nice pass for the first down. Three. Three. 
They'll go Brown. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Gaining five yards. That brings him second and five. From the 48-yard line. Second down. And down he goes at the 47. He's going to try to cough and corner this one. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideouts. Number 17 was the intended receiver on the play. It's second and 10. Ball on the 20-yard line. Fires out to his receiver. And they make the stop at the 27-yard line. Call it a gain of seven yards. That makes it third and three. Fires to his tight end, nothing doing. This wide receiver is very frustrated. You can tell by his body length. He did everything he needed to do to get open to be able to make a big play. The quarterback just didn't put the ball in the money. Lyons is back deep to return the punt. Booming kick. Looking for the corner, he's at the 40. He wasn't breaking that tackle. What a hit. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. Washington comes to the line in complete control in this game. Johnson on the inside handoff. They'll bring him down at about the 29-yard line. That'll bring up second and 11. Second down and 11. Ball on the 29. They bring him down in the backfield. Well, give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. Dumps it complete to the halfback over the middle. He's tackled around the 24-yard line. Down. That's, That's a gain of six, six on the play. play. That'll, That'll make, make it fourth and six. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. Kicks away, and it's good. That one looked like cake for this kid. Chalk up three points for the offense. So our score, Washington 40, Utah nothing. Bernard 
Gross has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. Bernard from the four. He's to the 20. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Late in the fourth quarter, this game's not even close. It's a blowout. A lot of folks have already gone home, and Herbie, I think we're going to make our dinner reservations. A little over a minute in the game. Gets out to about the 31. Gain three yards. That'll make it second and seven. From their own 31-yard line, it's second down. Makes the catch and look out. He's knocked out of bounds at the 39. Gain of eight yards. First down. He throws it. Pulls it in. First down, and he's knocked out of bounds. That's good for a game of 14 yards. First down. First and 10. Ball on the 47. And they'll get him in the backfield. There are a lot of players in the college game that can make something happen when the blocking breaks down. But when it's that bad, I don't care who you are, you're going down for a loss. He's going to go for the home run. Excellent execution on one side of the ball that time. And it looks to me like the defense was in a little state of confusion. Let's see if they can pull themselves together. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Tackle made right around the four-yard line. Glover was the intended receiver on the play. That brings up second and goal. That's the end of the ball game, and our final score on this one, Washington, 40, Utah, nothing. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.